Hey guys, welcome to another Spigot plugin tutorial and today it's on the plugin Teams. So this is a really awesome plugin that allows uh, players to set up teams with friends and whatnot. Uh, and there's lots of different options you can set. So if you do forward slash team, followed by help, it shows you the first page of commands and help to shows you the second. So you can set uh, a team home, friendly fire on and off, you can have a look at team members and you can create and disband teams as you wish. So I'm going to disband my team, which is Team YouTube at the moment. So I'm going to create a new one with Lincoln Park over here. So let's do that. So uh, we're going to create the team and we're going to call it uh, Ducks, like that. So we have created a team with the name Ducks. So obviously we want Lincoln Park in it, so we do team, followed by invite, and then Lincoln Park's name. There we go. So we send him an invite, and all he has to do is team accept, and he will join. So if we do team members, it should just be us two. There we go, like that. And if we do team list, that shows us um, the teams that we've joined and the teams created. So I did try one with a color code. Um, that didn't work. It did say color, color code support, so not sure about that. But uh, yeah, still, still pretty awesome. So. Um, not only that, but we can actually set a team home. So um, this chicken, this chicken pen is going to be our team home. So if we do team set home, like that, that sets the team home. So if we do team and then home, we get teleported to our home area, which is really, really cool. Um, very, very nice. So obviously you can team accept or team decline, depending on um, where you want to join them. You can do team info, the ducks. So capital letters do apply. So if I actually put a small d, uh, yep, hit the wrong letter there. Sorry about that. <laughs> um, ducks, yes. So a team with that name could not be found. So my team, two members, just me and Lincoln Park, and I'm the team leader. So that is very, very, very cool. Another really cool feature of this plugin is that you can enable or disable friendly fire by doing team, friendly, and then fire, and either on or off. So if it's off, you won't be able to do damage to your friends, uh, but if it's on, you will still be able to hit them and um, knock them about and whatnot. So it's a very cool plugin. You can edit lots of things in the config, so you can change the maximum amount of uh, teams people can create and you can change the max amount of members, I believe, and obviously all the text and color codes, you can mess around with that how you like. So yeah, that's the plugin. It's very, very cool. I definitely recommend it. And uh, yeah, it was requested by a guy who commented, so thanks to him for showing me this really cool plugin. So yeah, that's it. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you uh, next time.